Hi, I'm Joel Lightcatcher. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new, I talk about bikes, trikes, e-bikes, and all kinds of interesting things that help people be active and enjoy life. So today I'm going to be talking about e-bikes for seniors. And I qualify, I'm 62. Hi, Joel Lightcatcher here, and today I'm talking about e-bikes for seniors. Now, I'm on a long wheelbase recumbent, and that may not be your cup of tea, but it doesn't matter. You can buy a purpose-built e-bike at a local bike shop with a low step over, so you can get your foot on that bike without raising and swinging your leg over the seat like you used to. Let me get onto the trail here. Little bump, little grass and I'm back on the path. And here I'm just using a little throttle because that grass took some of my speed away and now I'm pedaling again under my own power. And that's the beauty of having a throttle. It just gives you a little assistance when you need it. Like here, I'm coming into a turn. I slow down, harder to pedal, give it a little thumb, come up to speed. And now I'm pedaling again comfortably under my own power with just a little assistance. I'm only going 15 miles an hour. And if you're a senior, you probably don't feel like you want to go faster. I mean, it, and if you're really well fit and you're in your 60s, go for it. Go get a mountain bike with a powerful mid-drive motor and go for it. Be as active as you want. But if you're like most people, here I'm, I'm 62 now. I just had my birthday a few weeks ago. And I can't ride like I did when I was 30. I've got a carbon fiber racing bike and I cannot get my leg over it. I can't ride it anymore. I gotta sell my beloved carbon fiber Scott bike. But that's another story. You see, uh, about seven months ago, I had my left hip replaced. That's all healed up and great, but unfortunately, my left quad muscle is really weak. I sometimes have to use my hand to help my leg up to uh, get my foot on the pedal or even put on a pair of pants. It's weak. I'm working on it. I'm changing my uh, bikes from uh, my trike to my two-wheeled recumbent here and probably my mountain bike to get more workout, a better workout on that quad muscle. And on my right knee, well, that needs a replacement. I'm waiting for this summer to get that done. So it hurts every now and then. I cannot walk the dog all the way around the block without a little pain. But I can ride this bike or my trike with my e-assist for four hours, no problem. And if I get a little tired, I'll just use the thumb assist to get me home. It's really wonderful. And I can ride, if I wanna ride 25 miles an hour and feel like a kid again, I can do that. And I'm not really riding any harder than I would be at uh, 12 or 15 miles an hour. So it's a wonderful experience to have the e-bike and in my particular case I also have a heart problem I have a bundle block I'm sorry a bundle branch block which means the top of my heart and the bottom of my heart lose connection when I'm doing very hard vigorous exercise and what happens is my heart rate will jump 20 30 40 beats a minute um, it first happened when I was using my carbon fiber racing bike back in the late 2000s and it, I actually landed in, a, in an ambulance ride home because my heart rate went up to 170 beats a minute and wouldn't come down for 20 minutes. Very, very scary. I thought I was having a heart attack. Anyway, so after a month and lots of tests, we found out the answer. So I have a Garmin computer here and that tells me what my heart rate is. And I always wanna keep it under 130 because right now my max is 160 beats a minute. And I'm always, you know, I go around 120, really around 120 beats a minute is where, I'm, where my comfort zone is now. And with the e-assist, I can moderate how much effort I apply so I can control my heart rate better. I don't have a problem. You know, once in a while I might have a little issue. Oh, let's ring these people. Hello. And um, I once had a problem and it takes about 15 to 30 minutes for my bundle block to relax and then my heart's better and during that time I'll just use my throttle and not pedal at all so for someone who's 50 60 70 and having a few issues 
getting a bike with e-assist in any form is super beneficial. I've been out here riding for over two hours. I feel amazing. My heart rate's about 98. I burned all the calories I gained at the Christmas party last weekend. And I really feel sharp in the head, wonderful. I'm gonna be very productive when I get home, back at my desk editing this video. So please, uh, if you don't live in South Florida, go to a reputable bike shop and find one or you can order online rad rover is a well-known e-bike online brand um, that i've known have personal experience with but i've heard wonderful things about uh, if you're in south florida give me a call uh, my company is get back trikes i don't sell bikes but i do e-bike conversions and i could take the bike you already love and turn it into an e-bike with a falco system which i uh, have a franchise for down here in Florida So uh, what more can I say get an e-bike feel better get out make friends join a bike club ride with your friends You could ride with young people and your grandkids like you never could before if you had an e-bike Anyway, that's Joel Lightcatcher for now. I'm Joel Lightcatcher. That's not Joel Lightcatcher. I'm Joel Lightcatcher. Anyway, uh, please subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button. Uh, hit the notification. It helps me grow this channel. I need to get a thousand members or more. This is a very niche market that I am uh, playing to. People like you who are thinking about e-bikes or love bikes in general. So your vote counts. Please like my video so uh, YouTube will help me spread my information to more people and share the love. Thanks very much. Have a wonderful day and enjoy the ride. Bye-bye.